Hi! Welcome to Rock and Roll. Are you ready to get started? Come on in. Bells are ringing, bells are ringing. Hear them chime, hear them chime. Calling all the children, calling all the children. It's romp and roll time. It's romp and roll time. Hi, everybody. Oh, I'm so glad you're here with me today. We are going to have so much fun together. Oh, I love our babies and toddlers classes. They are so important for our little one's development. I love it. Our little ones are growing and learning so much at these stages. So why not give them a special class to help improve their growth and help support you as well? We're going to get started, of course, by calling out our pet dog, Rompy, so he can come out and say hello. If you can put your little one in, there, in your lap, hold their arms out to the side, and rock side to side. We're going to be working on their core and side muscles as they rock, and we're going to sing, Oh, where, oh, where can Rompy be? Oh, where, oh, where can he be? With his big brown eyes and his waggly tail. Oh, where, oh, where can he be? All right, next we're going to count to three on our fingers before we say, come out, Rompy. Here we go. One, two, three. Come out, Rompy. <gasps> Look, I think I see Rompy's feet. Oh, he's got some stompy paws. <gasps> I think, look, I see Rompy's waggly tail. <gasps> Here he <gasps> is. Yay, it's Rompy. Oh, how exciting. Oh, I'm so glad that he gets to come out and play with us today. We're going to rock one more time and sing our hello song. Again, rocking is great for our little ones. With these activities, when we're rocking side to side, we're actually looking for them to try to hold themselves up, working on their neck muscles. All right, are you ready? Here we go. Oh, here we are at romp and roll, at romp and roll, at romp and roll. Oh, here we are at romp and roll. Let's wiggle those fingers. We're going to say, get ready for some fun. And fun with Miss Allison. That's me. And fun with Rompy. That's him. And fun with all our friends. That's you. <laughs> oh, here we are at Romp and Roll. One more time. Get ready for some fun. Oh, so much fun today. You know what? Rompy has an amazing story in the backpack for us. Let's pat our legs, making a rhythm. There we go just like that. And we're going to sing, what's in the backpack? What's in the backpack? What's in the backpack? Let's all look. Let's see what we have in here today. <clears throat> oh, this is one of my favorite books by one of my favorite authors ever. It's Oh My, Oh My, Oh Dinosaurs by Sandra Boynton. Here we go. Let's see what we have here. Look at, look at all those dinosaurs. Oh, I'm so excited. <clears throat> oh my, oh my, oh my, oh, dinosaurs. <gasps> dinosaurs happy? <gasps> dinosaurs sad. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> it looks like the balloon popped. <gasps> dinosaurs good? Look at them painting. Ah, lovely. And dinosaurs bad. Ah, they're super silly dinosaurs. <clears throat> dinosaurs big. And dinosaurs tiny. Dinosaurs smooth. And dinosaurs spiny. Ugh. Dinosaurs weak. 
and dinosaurs strong. Oh, show me those strong muscles. Oh, where are those strong muscles at? Dinosaur singing a dinosaur song. Look at them all singing. Ah, I love some good dinosaurs. <gasps> dinosaurs cold. <gasps> and dinosaurs hot. <gasps> dinosaurs cute. <gasps> and dinosaurs not. Dinosaurs early. Oh. And dinosaurs later. Oh. Dinosaurs crammed in an elevator. Oh, look at all those dinosaurs all together. Oh, super silly. Dinosaurs plump. And dinosaurs lean. Dinosaurs red, blue, yellow, and green. Oh, dinosaurs looking right at you to say goodbye because we are through the end. Oh my goodness, what a wonderful book. I'm so glad that we got to read this one today. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this back in the, in the backpack, put that off to the side. Now grown-ups, we're gonna do some lap ride and movement songs next. I love these songs. You can take them anywhere with you. You can do them in the living room, you can do them in the bedroom, you can do them at the doctor's office for your checkups. They are great time fillers. Get your little one giggling, get them distracted in case they need it. Um, Cause you know, every once in a while, we may need a little bit of help. So I'm gonna start by standing up and doing a song called I'm a Little Rocket. So we're going to stand up. We're gonna take our little ones and we're going to hold them right underneath the arms. Now, grown-ups, I do want to give you a little bit of fair warning. Whenever you pick up your little ones, make sure you're not putting any stress on your thumb. It really hurts over time. You get tendonitis in your hand. It's called mommy's thumb. Um, and trust me, I've had it before. It's not fun. You don't want that pain. So whenever you're picking up your little one, make sure you're holding them by the palm of your hand, squishing them like this with no weight on your thumbs. All right, so I'm gonna hold Rompy right here underneath his arms. I'm gonna put his feet right here on the ground, just barely touching, and we're gonna rock side to side. And this song goes, I'm a little rocket way up high. Here comes the fun, whirling around and watch me fly. When I'm getting ready, then you'll know it's three, two, one, blast off, up I go. Did you like that, Rompy? That one was a really fun one. I hope you enjoyed it too. You can sing that song anytime you like. All right, let's do it one more time. So that we get the hang of it. You ready? Put your little one's feet right on the ground and we're gonna rock side to side and we're gonna sing, I'm a little rocket way up high, whirling around and watch me fly. When I'm getting ready, then you'll know it's three, two, one, blast off, up I go. Yay! Oh, that one was super, super duper silly. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and have a seat now um, with this song. We're gonna be singing a song called Boom Boom. Again, lap rides are fun because you can do these anywhere and they're great distractors for our little ones. Bouncing is an amazing skill for us to work on with our, with our children. Um, it works on a variety of skills. It works on our back and neck muscles as we have to hold ourselves up to bounce. The lower you help support your little one, the more work they have to do. So the smaller the baby, the smaller the bounces, and the smaller the baby, the more support you want to give when you're doing these bounces. This also helps work on their neck muscles. It also even helps work on their language development because as they're bouncing, they're having to control their jaw muscles. So their mouth's not flapping open. So this uh, bouncing is amazing for our little ones. All right, so we're gonna start by singing a song called Boom Boom. Super silly and it goes, 
Boom, boom, ain't it great to be bouncing? Boom, boom, ain't it great to be bouncing? Silly and foolish the whole day through. Boom, boom, ain't it great to be bouncing? <gasps> Let's rock side to side, getting our little ones to stretch that neck and help try to hold themselves upright. You ready? Boom, boom, ain't it great to be rocking? Boom, boom, ain't it great to be rocking? Silly and foolish the whole day through. Boom, boom, ain't it great to be rocking? We're gonna do some hugging now, getting them nice and close. Boom, boom, ain't it great to be hugging? Boom, boom, ain't it great to be hugging? Silly and foolish the whole day through. Boom, boom, ain't it great to be hugging? Let's get some more giggles. Let's go back to bouncing. <gasps> boom, boom, ain't it great to be bouncing? Boom, boom, ain't it great to be bouncing? Silly and foolish the whole day through. Boom, boom, ain't it great to be bouncing? Yay! Oh, that one was super silly. Thank you. All right, so we're gonna do one more activity with our little ones um, right now. This is a good one where we're going to be helping our little ones. Um, we're gonna be just desensitizing their hands a little bit for our next activity after this. Um, we're going to be playing with their hands, giving them a little bit of a tickle, um, having a lot of fun with it. So I'm going to take our little one. I'm gonna turn Rompy around so he's facing me. There we go, putting him in my lap, however works best. <clears throat> and I'm gonna take his arm and I'm gonna take his hand. When we're rubbing their hand for this song, grown-ups, I want you to start at the inside of the palm and press out. We're gonna do this a little more uh, hard instead of soft, um, just kind of desensitizing their hands um, as we go through to help prepare them for our next activity. So this song goes, <clears throat> round and round the garden goes the teddy bear. One step, two steps, tickle you under there. We're gonna go back to that hand. Round and round the garden, through the wind and rain. One step, two step, tickle you there again. Let's switch hands and do it one more time. You ready? <clears throat> round and round the garden goes the teddy bear. One step, two steps, tickle you under there. <gasps> round and round the garden, through the wind and rain. One step, two step. Tickle you there again. Oh, yay. That was fabulous. Thank you so much for joining me. All right. Now, grown-ups, for this next activity, it helps to have a, um, a, some yarn, some string, some tassels, um, maybe even maybe a, a baby blanket or um, a lovey that your little one loves to reach out for or just uh, is soft. Um, we have these really cool ribbon bells. I'm gonna use these today. I love these ribbon bells because we have all the different colors hanging down. We also have the bells on the end to make some noise for distractions. Um, so we use these during our classes, but again, at home, you can really use anything that dangles for our little ones. We're gonna do something called baby fishing. We're gonna get our little ones going. We're gonna try to activate their grasping reflex um, in their hands. So that's called the Palmer Reflex. So what we're gonna be doing is taking our little ones, um, we're gonna leave them on their back for this one. <clears throat> and we're just gonna slowly head over to their hands, depending on your little one's age, of course. This is good for our little ones, little, little, little ones. And I'll show you how to do it with the bigger ones in just a moment. All right, so we're gonna take this and we're just gonna simply tickle, tickle, tickle their hand. Our goal is to get them to close that palm, boop, 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 reaching, closing that palm, and then we're going to get them to pull a little bit. We're gonna pull, 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 and if our little ones are holding nice and tight, we're gonna try to encourage them to roll over with it, or just take their arm and cross the midline, activating both sides of their brain. Getting them going, yeah. So let's try it on the other hand too. So we're gonna come over here. We're gonna tickle our little one's hands. Tickle, 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 tickle. We're gonna try to get them to grab hold. And then we're going to try to pull them over. Working on that rolling, taking that arm, getting that other arm out of the way. Ah, oh, 
Yes, how fun, Romby, you did a great job. Now that is definitely for our younger, younger little babies who are working on rolling, who are still working on that grasping skills. If you happen to have an older one, um, an older little one, a toddler, um, we can do a couple of other activities as well with this. We can have them on their belly if they are um, confident and they have that upper body strength to go on just one arm. We can have them on one arm reaching out with the other. Come here, Rumpy. Let's put your arm down. There we go. Have them try to reach out and grab. There we go. Grabbing, grabbing, grabbing. We can also have them boop, 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 boop. try to come and catch it until they catch up and grab hold of those ribbons. Of course, as our little ones do grab hold of our ribbons, um, we want to make sure that um, we do give them a little bit of a reward. I know that sometimes we want to we want to tease our little ones with with a toy or something like that. We try to get them to work harder and harder and harder, reaching a little bit farther and a little bit farther. We want them to have fun and we want them to to grow and everything. But make sure that you give them a little bit of time to play with whatever toy it is, um, with with uh, observation, especially with these ribbons. Um, and then once they're once you've played a little bit, try again. Grab them, grab hold, pull them, have fun with it. And then as soon as they're frustrated, it is okay to put this away for another activity and another time. All right. I've had so much fun with you. I think it's time for us to sing a couple more songs before we sing goodbye. All right. <clears throat> this one is one of my favorites. I'm going to show you On Me first, and then we can do it with Rompy as well. Um, it's called On My Foot. And it goes... <clears throat> On my foot, there is a flea. Now he's climbing up on me, <gasps> past my belly, <gasps> past my nose, on my head, where my hair grows. <gasps> on my head, there is a flea. Now he's climbing down on me, <gasps> past my belly, past my knee, <gasps> on my foot. Oh, hello there, flea. So now that I've shown you on me, let's do it with your little ones. This is a great one. We're going to just be gently touching our little ones, tickling them all around. And it goes, on my foot, there is a flea. Now he's climbing up on me, past my belly, past my nose, on my head where my hair grows. Ooh, give him a little massage. On my head, there is a flea. Now he's climbing down on me, past my belly, past my knee, on my foot. Oh. Hello there, Flea. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for joining us today. I've had so much fun playing with you. Make sure that you join us all next week. We're going to be going live right here on the Romp and Roll page at 10 a.m. every single day with another baby's class next Friday where we're going to be focusing in on tummy time for your little ones um, at a variety of ages and a variety of stages. So it's going to be a lot of fun. All right, it's time for us to sing our goodbye song. Let's take our little hands and go clap, 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 clap. Clap, clap, clap. Let's take our little hands and go clap, clap, clap. Clap, clap, clap. Let's take our little feet and go stomp, stomp, stomp. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Let's take our little feet and go stomp, stomp, stomp. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Let's take our little arms and go hug, hug, hug. Hug, hug, hug. Hug, hug. Hug. Let's take our little arms and go hug, 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 hug. Let's take our little hands and wave bye, 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 bye. Let's take our little hands and wave bye, bye, bye. We'll see you here next time. Don't forget, in the comments, we have a link to all of our amazing merchandise, including our little rompies, some t-shirts, and some shakers for you as well. Bye-bye, Miss Allison. Bye-bye, Rompy. Bye-bye, everybody. We'll see you here next time. Bye, everybody.